Hey, Mike Davenport, Louisville's Chevy dude here at Bachman Chevrolet in Louisville, Kentucky. As you know, I am one of the top Chevrolet salesmen in the country, and I love selling these Corvettes. Now, this is a very, very few of our Corvettes. I have some over there, if you can see them in the background, right about here. And then I also have a whole lot more up there by the Marriott, way up there. Uh, so I have Corvettes everywhere. I'm also one of the top Camaro salesmen as well. You can see I've got a lot of Camaros. I got a lot of everything being that we're a top 200 Chevy dealer. So uh, I'm very, very involved with the Corvette and the Camaro community. Matter of fact, I own both. I own a Corvette 2016, I own a 2016 2SS Camaro, and I own a 2015 RS, 2LT RS Camaro. So to say the least, I'm I'm a buyer and I've invested in the brand and I love the brand. But uh, I've got some exciting news today. I'm gonna show you the brand new carbon matrix color. Absolutely beautiful. And then I got a huge surprise, huge surprise. Something that nobody in the world has got. So pay attention, watch the whole video, thumbs up the video, and you're gonna wanna share this because this is huge, huge news. This is the uh, old build your own Corvette uh, option code, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, the customer's building this himself. I don't know what's going on here. I know it's been back here for a while, but uh, it doesn't look good. There's the engine. Were you uh, out hot lapping this, Brett? Oh, that's the customer's fault. It's never the customer. It's never the customer's fault, is it? It's always our fault. Less than less than 300 miles. Smoke two rods. Smoke two rods. Wow. Point those out to me. Spun the bearings. Spun the bearings. Oh wow, yeah. Put some light on that. You gotta have no oil or high RPM to do that. Yep. Yep. That's amazing. On the highway, doing the pedals. That's interesting. Not a good day for him, huh? This car is a hard to blow up guy. They are a hard to blow up. You're right. I know that. You got to do all that to get the engine out, huh? It's a lot of work. Whew, 300 miles. Would not be happy. Not a, not a grand sport. I wouldn't be happy. With what do we have here? It's a new Corvette. The new color Corvette. Oh, it's a Z06 as well. This is the carbon ceramic matrix gray. Wow. This is cool. Let's check this. Let's check this out. Yeah, this is an awesome color. This is the first time that I'm seeing this color in person. Had an idea what it looked like. I was not able to make it to the uh, bash. Uh, now you can see what a Corvette looks like coming in uh, off the truck. We uh, we cut these uh, really silly car covers off of the vehicles, but this looks like a uh, Z06 carbon car. Let's look at the options here. So this is a 2LZ. Hey, you got the keys to this, Brad? Has performance data recorder, automatic transmission, black wheels, red seat belts, ceramic matrix gray, a drilling red interior. Looks pretty cool. Looks pretty cool. Gotta love the black wheels. I love this new color. I love this new color. Let's get some shade. Let's get some shade here. Kind of show you up close what this color is like in the shade and with sun. So really, it's really, really sparkly. Really great color. 
And there it is. Complete 100% shade. Sun up top here. You can see the huge difference between the two colors. There and there. And of course the white protective color. Oh, it's unlocked. Sweet. So we can see the red seat belts in here. The red seats inside here. how it comes straight from the factory the dealer must remove I'm gonna make the customer remove that just out of spite because I don't like being told what to do open this up these are your wicker bills here so those get installed right there they do those from the factory that's your one of your those are your front corner pieces. You got your vehicle build right there. That comes on the car. That gets this gets uh, stated uh, or gets placed on the hood until the end of the until the end of the assembly line. We got all the parts that you need to put on the cars. The ground effects come through FedEx, so we get those in the back already. We'll put the ground effects. On. Looks like this is getting uh, the stage one ground effects. Did I miss them on here? Yep. So this is going to have stage one ground effects, so they won't have the uh, the high crazy ground effects on it. Also, uh, after looking at that broke Corvette, I'm glad I uh, tell my customers all the break-in procedures because that customer did not buy that car here. They bought it from a dealer that uh, wants to cheap sell stuff and uh, our customer's a little upset. So um, I got this nice yellow one all sold. This is the used 14 and uh, it's, it's already broke in so I don't have to worry about talking about break-in procedure with this. I will talk about cold start procedure though because there is a little bit of procedure on that. Um, kind of like the break-in power but uh, I've got this sold. It's used and uh, like I do with most of my customers I like to deliver them right off the showroom floor. Number one, it's in the upper 90s here. Uh, the humidity is like 218%. And uh, so being inside is much better than being out here. So let's back this in and uh, deliver the car to the customer here in a little bit. All right, we're missing something here. What could we be missing? Ah, oh, here it is. This is what we are missing. Oh man, that's a horrible throw. There we go, that's better. Now that car is all ready for delivery and the really cool part is we live in a town with 6,000 plus Ford employees, and this would be going to one of those Ford employees. Love it. So, uh, and they bought a, yesterday, yesterday they bought a Colorado ZR2. Both Ford employees driving Chevys. It tells you something, doesn't it? So here is the exciting part that I was gonna tell you. Nobody in the world knows this. Nobody in the world has this picture. Um, I can't tell you how I took it, um, but I did take the picture and it's an amazing discovery, but uh, Midigen Corvette, here it is. And these would be your mid-engine Corvette rear quarter panels. As you see coming up in the next photo, these are aligned perfectly with the spy photo. And to my information, these will actually lift up with the deck lid to gain access to the mid-engine. Please like and share my video and subscribe to my videos.